If you think there's a lack of sunlight in the winter where you live, imagine a night that lasts a few days or even several months. That's what residents of some regions of the world get to experience when the polar night begins. Here are 20 places where it's almost always night in the winter. Longyearbyen, Svalbard, Norway Longyearbyen, Norway, is the northernmost inhabited city in the world, located at 78 degrees latitude. The polar night, Polarnet, lasts about four months, from the end of October to mid-February. Antarctica Antarctica also experiences the polar night, but in July. Located in the southern hemisphere, the seasons are the opposite of those in North America. At this time of year, those stationed in Antarctica experience the midnight sun, where it's almost always daytime. It's also the only place in the southern hemisphere that gets these variations in sunlight. The North Pole If Antarctica has the polar night, it goes without saying that the other side of the globe, the North Pole, does as well. The night lasts six months, from September to March, followed by six months of sunlight. Santa Claus certainly lives in an amazing place. Unfortunately, it's impossible to visit the North Pole, as it's only an ice sheet floating in the ocean. Tramso, Norway The small island of Tramso, Norway, is 321 kilometers, 200 miles, north of the Arctic Circle at 69 degrees latitude versus 66 degrees. The polar night lasts from November to January, then the nights get shorter, giving way to the midnight sun from May to July. About 70,000 people live there. It's also home to the world's northernmost university, the University of Tromso. Barrow, Alaska, United States. Barrow, Alaska, is the northernmost village in the United States. The night lasts about 60 days, but residents can enjoy dusk, which lasts up to three hours. About 4,000 people lie there. Alert, Nunavut, Canada. Alert, Nunavut, is the northernmost permanently inhabited place in the world. Located just 800 kilometers, 500 miles, from the North Pole, Alert experiences several months of the polar night every year. Only military personnel and scientists work there. Karuna, Sweden The polar night spans about 28 days in Karuna, Sweden. The city is located 50 kilometers, 31 miles, north of the Arctic Circle. During the polar night, the only daylight is dusk. Reykjavik, Iceland Reykjavik is the capital of the northernmost independent country on Earth and only gets about four hours of sunlight on December 21st. The sun doesn't rise until after 11 in the morning and is dim like dusk. By 3 in the afternoon, night returns. On the flip side, residents are paid back in the summer when the days seem endless. Cape Nordkin and Nordkap, Norway Cape Nordkin, Norway is mainland Europe's northernmost point, about 5.7 kilometers, 3.5 miles, closer to the North Pole, the North Cape, Nord Cap, on Major Royal Island, is Europe's northernmost point. Both capes have a polar night that spans from the end of November to mid-January, when you can experience the blue hour at noon. Murmansk, Russia The 300,000 odd residents of Murmansk, in northwestern Russia, live in an eternal night that lasts for about six weeks every winter. It is the world's largest city north of the Arctic Circle. Surprisingly, the average temperature is not too bad, rarely dipping below the 10 degrees Celsius, 14 degrees Fahrenheit, mark. Saks Harbor, Northwest Territories, Canada Saks Harbor, Northwest Territories, is home to fewer than 150 people. The town sits at 71 degrees latitude, which means that from November to January, residents never get to see the sun. Jan Mayen, Norway Jan Mayen is a Norwegian island located northwest of Iceland. The island rarely gets any sun because, along with being at a latitude of 78 degrees and having a polar night that runs from mid-November to the end of January, it tends to be cloudy all year long. Lapland, Finland Lapland, Finland, experiences the Kamos or the polar night. This region, which represents about a quarter of the country, is located north of the Arctic Circle. Farther south, in the capital of Helsinki, daylight lasts for less than six hours on the winter solstice. 
Greenland. The island of Greenland belongs to Denmark. The polar night is part of their winter reality. And yet it's never completely dark during the day, as a faint light splashes pastel hues over the landscape. One of the perks of the season is seeing the northern lights. Old Crow, Yukon, Canada Fewer than 300 people presently reside in Old Crow, one of the northernmost villages in the Yukon Territory. It's located north of the Arctic Circle, which means it gets the polar night. On top of that, there's no road to get there you have to take an airplane or a snowmobile in the winter. Narian Mar, Russia The climate of Narian Mar, Russia, is subarctic meaning they have very cold winters. From the start of October to the end of May, snow covers the ground. During this time, particularly in December, it's rare to see the sun. Estonia Estonia is located just below Finland. The country is south of the Arctic Circle, so it doesn't get the polar night, but the days are very short in the winter. The capital, Tallinn, only gets six hours of sunlight on the winter solstice. In comparison, Montreal gets one hour or more. Kirovsk, Russia South of Murmansk, which is also on this list, lies the city of Kirovsk, home to the northernmost botanical garden in Russia. The ski industry is drawing ever more tourists, despite the lack of winter sunlight thanks to Kirovsk's location at 59 degrees latitude. Bodo, Norway At 67 degrees latitude, Bodo is the second largest city in northern Norway. The city is a popular departure point for visiting nearby attractions. Located just north of the Arctic Circle, they don't get a true polar night, as the sun rises over the horizon, but not very high. Norilsk, Russia Norilsk is the second largest city in the world located north of the Arctic Circle with a population of more than 175,000. It is also the northernmost city in Siberia. The city is extremely polluted because of its industry, and the winters are brutal, with extremely cold temperatures and very little sunlight. 